welcome back to my channel and today I'm doing another grocery haul I haven't done one of these in forever I know the lighting is very old school I'm in my kitchen and yeah my equipment is in my car but I wanted to do a grocery haul I haven't done one in a while and this is the first time that I've actually bought a lot of groceries was well, really not that many now I really enjoy the Walmart grocery pickup service but that was a little behind on my order like it should have been ready earlier I got some staples that everybody keeps in their house you know I have a 12 count of eggs bread Sara Lee butter bread is my favorite so it's just really I don't know I just really enjoy this bread one of the meals that I'm gonna be making involves like sandwiches as for my favorite little snack items y'all know I really like foodles I've been eating these forever so good i only like the ones with the crackers and the cheese i don't really like pizzas that you have to put in the oven but i saw this and i was like you know when you're ordering groceries online like low-key you can really just get the things that you need but there's a 30 dollar minimum so i was like five dollars for a big pizza that might be good it said rise and crust and it really got me so i got this DiGiorno pizza five bucks i also got two containers of ground beef one costs more than the other one one is 80 percent um lean and this one is 73 percent i don't know why i just didn't double up on the 80 percent but hey just two one pound containers of ground beef i plan on making spaghetti and tacos so i just need to make sure i have enough ground beef for both of those meals for la tacos i need the i got some triple cheddar cheese so you know just regular cheese so again for the tacos i got some shredded iceberg lettuce i got some tortilla wraps yeah some flour tortillas these say for fajitas but i'm gonna make tacos with them i also have a roma tomato i have a bell pepper and i got an onion so this is basically for my spaghetti and probably what else some of the onion is going to be used towards my tuna salad that i am making as well and this is just for the tacos i also ordered some mozzarella sticks so i got the snap kind these are a dollar and they were out of this one i guess this was the last one so i also got some great value mozzarella sticks this one is actually more hold on it's more in here Okay. I really like making my own tuna so I have the four pack of the great value chuck like tuna in water I always get the tuna in water so I have that so normally I do like two cans per time I make it I have a tuna recipe my tuna be fine it be spicy it be delicious <laughs> so again I told you guys I was gonna be making spaghetti as one of my meals so I got some Bertoli organic non GMO tomato basil sauce and then i got some great value just spaghetti noodles and yeah i'm gonna make some spaghetti to go along with the cheeses that i had i also got just this block of sharp cheddar cheese people be calling this the wick cheese but y'all i'm telling y'all this make this cheese right here and some bread what you want to do is slice this up like that's my favorite meal as a kid everybody got their little childhood meal that they used to always eat mine was this cheese sliced up on bread put in the microwave for like 30 seconds delicious Ch change your life i call it cheese toast memories man we haven't had one of these in the house in so long this is the best cheese for grits eggs all of that it's the best cheese apparently i also bought some mayo i didn't even know i bought mayo first of all i don't use mayo for any other reasons besides making tuna because i really hate mayo but it just make the tuna come together but apparently i bought mayo next thing that i bought was a bag of uncle ben rice we have some at the crib but i decided to buy more this is my favorite rice you know you get the little portions it's four bags in here i just really like this this rice is really easy the thing is the other day i bought some soups and i don't see my soups in the kitchen the reason for the rice is that i pour like progresso soups over it and it's really really good so I bought the chicken noodle soup and then I also bought what I, buy? I bought beef stew. So I'm going to make those over rice. 
Now for breakfast items, I have really taken to these fruit and grain bars. This is the great value kind. Normally I used to get the Nutri-Grain bars, um, but these are like a whole dollar and ten cent less. And even with the Nutri-Grain bars, I only eat the mixed berry kind. So I tried the great value mixed berry and it's really good as well. So great value fruit and grain bars. These are really, really good and cheaper than Nutri-Grain bars. Taste the same, like I don't really taste the difference. Filling in this one to me is better. The last two things that I bought were some juices. So in the morning times, I like to have something to drink with my Nutri-Grain bar. Normally, oh, I forgot to get some fruit. This week at work, I had been bringing a Nutri-Grain bar and I had been eating like mandarin oranges that you have to peel. Like cuties, I had been bringing those to work and it's been very filling and I saved more money because normally every day I either buy something for lunch from the cafeteria downstairs or I go to like Burger King or something like that or McDonald's for breakfast and that gets expensive when you spend in like five to ten dollars a day on just breakfast when, you, when I also have to buy lunch if I don't bring it anyway so that's what I've been doing to cut down costs because I've been spending like three hundred dollars on eating out in this <laughs> <laughs> I cannot do it no more so anyway the last two things that I have are juice so I have a six pack orange juice I didn't even know great value had like an orange juice thing I've only seen it on the website like I've never seen I have never seen these in store but this was like three dollars versus the ocean spray which is like what $4.98 or something $3.98 and then I just have some of the apple of the mocks apple juice six pack so I'm going to take these to work and leave them at my desk or put them in a fridge or something there so I have it in the mornings because let me tell you, if I leave this here, it's too many children coming in and out of my house to me have my, my juice here. They're going to drink it all. I'm taking it to work, okay? <laughs> so guys, that is everything. I'm sorry the angle was like too close. It should have been zoomed out more, but I had already put this lens on and the other one... For, honestly, this lens brings in more light because my other lens was so dark. So, I'm sorry I was so zoomed in. Hopefully, you could see everything. And, yeah, where have you guys been cooking lately? I've been taking cooking with Tommy suggestions. Um, I did post, I did put up a poll earlier today. And I posted above in the cards as well. So, make sure that you click the I and give me your vote. So, the vote is between um cajun chicken pasta taco pizza which I, I was really excited about the taco pizza and like a poppy seed chicken and rice casserole so those are the three options i'm probably going to end up making all of them but whatever one that you guys want to see first please go ahead and vote for your favorite um there'll be a card and you guys it should popped up it should have popped up by now but it's on the side I click the eye with the circle around it and let me know what your vote is so yeah, if you have any more Cooking with Tommy suggestions, leave them down below. Please note that I don't eat seafood. Maybe I should make that a series, like trying seafood for the first time. Because your girl do not eat seafood, like. That actually might be a good series, but we'll see. Let me know your ideas and suggestions down below. And I'll see you guys in my next one. Don't forget to like this video if you liked it. Don't forget to leave a comment down below. And last but not least, ooh. Last but not least, if you like me and my content, then go ahead and hit that subscribe button and let me know so you can be a part of the family. So thank you guys, and I'll see you in my next video. Bye. Perfect.